Hey, how's it going, Andy? Here again. Um, I'm going to play one of my favourite songs ever. I know I say that about a lot of songs, but this is one of my favourite songs ever. Um, it's by Oasis. At, at Skull Talk tonight. Um, now I am going to assume that you know your basic chords to play this. Um, I'm not going to be sitting explaining what an E minor is or an E is or whatever. I will show you the variations in this song. Right, but a trick to it is your ring finger. This finger here. I wasn't doing anything cheeky. Ring finger, right? Second, uh, basically your second string from the bottom, third fret. Um, it doesn't move. Near enough, doesn't move the entire song. It stays there. So we're kind of just sort of working our way round it and adding in. Um, another wee trick is that on the verse, we're just playing it with that, but on the sounds after that, but. On the chorus, we're actually playing the pinky down. So essentially, that acts as an add nine or a sus four or whatever. And with the pinky down, it's still called sus fours and add nines. are still called the same chord because um, they've still got the same notes, but we're adding in. I'll show you what I mean. So we'll go with the, the verse first. It's the. Uh, what are they called? E minor seven. Repeats. What we're essentially playing is an E minor seven with this finger down. Now the strumming in it, um, he plays it different on the record. It's, it's a bit different from just sort of acoustic version. I'd I see generally in the, I know the, the record is acoustic as well, but the live sort of acoustic versions. Um, it does a sort of full strum, but on the video or the the real record, it sort of accentuates the bass notes, so it's and then sort of picks up the higher notes. And he's almost picking down the way. So he's sort of rather than the full thing, he's he's kind of sort of. I suppose a little bit. Um, so, back to the script E minor 7. Next, E sus 4. So, take them off. Again, leave that one there. And we're 4 string, 2nd fret. So, just 2 fingers on. Next chord, C add 9, uh, we're keeping everything there, so the two fingers are staying, and we're adding in, middle finger, 5th uh, string, 3rd fret. It's just for 2 that time, C add 9, then to a G, so essentially, just a G, bounce them up, but this time I like playing the full G, so we'll put that down, so it's the two fingers this time. Back to an E sus 4. Again, two fingers on, so you just go basically got your first finger and your third finger, basically a ring finger. Two. What we do is a wee ascending bass line, um, and all it is is the. So, all we're really moving first of we're playing A sus 4, move your first finger up one string, so fifth string, still in the second fret. And then we're doing a C add 9. So. Okay, so we'll play it through, E minor 7. G, D, a wee sort of hammer on with the pinky, still strumming it, but it's a G, G, E, E minor 
seven. But that's what I'm saying with the chorus. We're keeping the pinky on, around the E minor seven. We're playing at the start of the verse. We're keeping this on. So G, E, E minor seven. And the C add nine. The same C add nine we had there, we played before, but we're adding, we're keeping the pinky on. So again, G. We played again, it was the A slash 4. And I do a wee, a wee descending bass just back into the verse. So it's. Uh, so. Just the sixth string. 3rd fret, 2nd fret, and then at the E minor 7. There is a bit at the end, um, when he's playing the chorus. I'll show you that just now, it's basically the G again. Right. Well, it's the G. Same as. D, the same as. E minor. So the E minor 7, it's a D, but I'm keeping the pinky on, so, C add 9, and so it goes, D, C minor 7, D, C add 9, right, so all that is, is if you imagine a D sus 2, if we're playing a D, bottom finger off, yeah, Closer, so what? Uh, we're just actually hitting those two and off. So, um, D such two shape. If you like, slid up two frets, back down, and then basically first finger off. So just need two strings. Your um, second and third string. I'm saying off, you're actually going into a G, so it's open anyway. The strings open anyway, because you're just going into a G string. So. But again, right at the end is the sort of little ascending bass there. To finish off in an E minor, or you can do a sneaky wee one, which I quite like, as um, essentially first finger, fifth, fifth string, second fret, and your pinky. Uh, on the fourth string, fourth fret. Well, that's it. That's the whole song. Piece it together as you would like. Is essentially that's all the chords in it. Um, and hopefully that was helpful. Okay, thanks a lot. Cheers. Bye.